This day in history marks a very interesting era within the United States during the 1920s, a time when morality and politics came to a head. January 17th marks the start of the era of prohibition in the U.S., and so today is known as National Bootleggers Day. Welcome to Taco Cast Podcast. Every day is a holiday. No, really, it is. Did you know that literally every day is a holiday? I don't know about you, but I love having a reason to celebrate every day. Whether it's your favorite foods day or something else totally random, happy holiday to you. Not only does this date mark the occasion of the start of the time of prohibition, but also the distillation of Templeton Rye Whiskey, as well as the birthday of notorious gangster Al Capone. All three Three of these occasions intersect on this holiday of National Bootleggers Day 2. This holiday was only formally created back in 2015 by Infinium Spirits to celebrate Templeton Rye Whiskey, a whiskey made in Iowa during the time of Prohibition. The word bootlegger comes from the 1880s when people would conceal liquor in flasks in their boot when trading illegally with Native Americans. It was a trick made common by soldiers, too, who would sneak alcohol into boot camp, and thus the term became synonymous with someone smuggling booze in their boots. And so when Prohibition was formally declared on January 17th, 1920, gangsters and many others refused to comply with the law. Speakeasies and underground jazz clubs became popular joints, and bootleggers were hired to smuggle alcohol from across the nation's borders and from illegal distilleries within the U.S. into clubs. Even though it was risky, Gangsters, bootleggers, and the distilleries such as Templeton Rye were incredibly successful. Prohibition was aimed to see if making alcohol illegal would reduce crime and corruption rates. And so the assumption was that minimizing alcoholism would essentially be a cure to all unemployment and crimes. Not seeing those assumptions play out in reality, the prohibition laws were finally repealed in 1933, ending an interesting time in the U.S. where the underground ruled. Today is a great day to, of course, enjoy your favorite brand of rye whiskey or other liquor and party like it's 1920. Happy holiday, everyone, and I'll see you tomorrow.